that they did not want Satan, Satan did not want the human family to think that he or his angels existed. Right. The second point that you made had to do with taking control of people's minds. I Right. The third point was what? Was to destroy the Bible without burning it. Okay. See? And what was his strategy on that? On that? was very interesting because after the great general council it was decided that Satan would tutor Charles Darwin personally setting up the uh, uh, the principles of his theories of evolution he was tutored by Lucifer himself fallen Lucifer and at that time, it was understood, Satan and his uh, spirit counselors understood that if a person was led to believe in the theory of evolution, it would, in his life, destroy completely the, the, the uh, creation week of the Bible, the fall of man, and the plan of redemption. It would do away with it. In one fell swoop. Yeah. Now, he made a, a unique statement. He said that according to the spirits, Anyone that teaches a theory of evolution is considered to be a minister of a great religious system. See, they call it the religious system. Uh, the theory of evolution. <laughs> because it is a, a system of schooling people and getting them to disqualify themselves from being members of Christ's kingdom. And he said that every teacher of that theory is as a person of great value and receives a very special unction from Satan himself, giving great power to induce spiritual blindness, to convince and convert. Three capacities are given to those teachers of the theory. Then, that's not all. The priest says that Satan considers the teachers of the theory of evolution to be so valuable to him that in the sight of all the inhabitants of the galaxies, he assigns a retinue of bright, beautiful angels to follow that, that uh, educator all the remainder of his life. And that in the sight of the inhabitants of the galaxies is the greatest honor that he can bestow upon his workers, upon mankind, and to, uh, you know, until the controversy is finished.